And now, WJCL News, working for you. New attempt at 11, rather, a horrific case of show and tell. As Buford deputies say, a four year old brought two needles filled with heroin to preschool. Tonight, that boy's mother is behind bars, and investigators are trying to determine exactly how this happened. Low Country Bureau Chief Larry Sproul spent the day talking with investigators. Well, Kevin, this story has many people shocked today. Deputies say the boy's mom put the needles filled with heroin inside his book bag. A decision that has people asking how and why. Things outside Christ Lutheran Preschool are pretty calm Thursday night, but Monday, that was a different story after needles were found in a little boy's backpack. We tested the substance that was actually in the, in the needles that were brought to school and it did field test positive for heroin. Sergeant Robin McIntosh says it was here at Christ Lutheran Preschool where the little boy brought the needles with him. It was during that time where he pulled out the needles and showed his teacher. That teacher then called law enforcement. Now in this police report, teacher Nandy Condor told investigators the boy had no idea how the needles got into his bag. The teacher also told the deputy she talked with the boy's father before about his struggle to help control the mother's drug use. McIntosh says they later found out the mother placed the needles inside the boy's bag. Deputies arrested 32-year-old Jenna George for child neglect. It's very disturbing um, and just all of the what-ifs that could come in to, to play here with a child bringing a material like this to school. Now it's here at Port Royal Plantation where Let's just say this story takes a different turn. Robin McIntosh says during the investigation, they went inside the home. That's when they found two more needles. But take a listen to this. Those two needles were found under one of the kids' beds. When deputies asked the father, Brian George, about the drugs, he says his wife had been acting strange and wearing long sleeve shirts the last couple of weeks. And if you're doing drugs, heroin oh my gosh that you know how can you be a mother and doing heroin at the same time a question that has parents and teacher nancy Silik confused and worried to know that your mom is a heroin addict or um, has some severe problems drug related problems you have to ca they, they'll carry that through their childhood and into adulthood as of right now, no charges will be filed against the husband, and the children are now living with the grandmother. Kevin? Such a heartbreaking story.